Well, set me on an anthill and rub jam in my ears. If that's the sound of my old air conditioner running, you just made yourself a new best friend. Now you just tell me what old Cooter can help you with. Like I was saying, folks say the famous pirate Phineas Crown built that house next door. Some say he's buried in the cemetery down the road. Folks around here are smart enough to stay clear of that place. Oh, Phineas Crown was a wicked one, all right. He used to run a smuggling operation out of New Orleans in the 1700s and eventually got into pirate in the Gulf of Mexico. He and his men would sneak up alongside trading ships in the middle of the night and <laughs> everyone on board. Instead of looting the ship, he'd steal the whole dang thing. No one knows what happened to the ships he plundered. Some folks say he sailed them right up the Mississippi and into the swamps around here. When he got too old for pirating, he built a big old mansion and threw a party. And it was there, people say, that a horrible fire broke out and killed every last guest. Detective, welcome to Louisiana. My name's Charlotte. Why don't you cool off with a nice cold glass of lemonade? I take it you've had the misfortune of meeting my other half, Cooter. Good mercy, where did I go wrong to marry that sack of bricks? Yes, we finally have some new faces just down the lane. I still should throw them a proper housewarming. I'm afraid Cooter doesn't like me leaving the house as he is just plumb sure that I will run off with another man. Anyway, I just spend my days watching my stories and working on my doll collection. Mr. Crickets belonged to my dear mother before she passed, rest her soul. You see, mother was deathly afraid of snakes. And since snakes are afraid of parrots, well, she found a feathered friend and a protector in Mr. Crickets. I apologize for the vulgarity the bird has learned from my loathsome husband. Oh, my dolls are my pride and joy. The doctor told us years ago that we should not have children because of Cooter's temper. But their tiny voices console me at night when I wish that I had made better life choices. Aside from Mr. Crickets, 
My dolls are my prized possession. I only need one more to complete my collection. And there's one in that game down at the tavern. But I've never had the good fortune of getting it out.
Ha <laughs> ha. 